Hey guys, welcome back. Um, today is our first day, official day in Fairfield. Um, we went and did a couple things earlier, but just real fast, not like anything we wanted to put into the video because it was just real <laughs> quick. Um, we had breakfast this morning, we did our Q&A video. Right now we're gonna go get some uh, lunch things, maybe to do some sandwiches. Um, but yeah, uh, I'm not gonna stay on here too long because we're using my phone to record and to also navigate. So we will see you guys in a bit. We'll probably record a little bit in the store, see what we're getting. Um, but yeah, today's kind of just a chillax day. Um, get things done, started and ready for the week. But we'll talk to you guys in a bit. Hey guys, so we just got out of the store and we're a little upset because we got some cold drinks <laughs> to drink and we left them in the trunk. This is what happens when you let people bag your stuff. <laughs> yeah, honestly, because we usually bag our own things and... I just didn't we, want to be rude, I was like... We'll usually take our sodas out ourselves. I didn't even think about that, but yeah, it's because we let them bag our things. <laughs> we almost left our chips too. <laughs> oh yeah, we almost forgot our chips because they didn't bag the chips and... Or put them in the basket. I was like, you're going to bag our stuff, but not bag our stuff. They were playing around too much. They're all toxic. Yeah, they were kind of, I don't know. But yeah, we're headed back to the hotel. Um, we're going to make some lunch because breakfast wasn't really breakfast. It was some granola bars and a bear claw. We still have it. We'll show <laughs> Yeah, we still have it. We haven't eaten it, but we got it. <laughs> and they gave us two water bottles. Um, but we got some sandwich meat, uh, some bread, some fruit bowls, a uh, salad to share, stuff like that, just to keep us by. Probably try out some places for dinner though, like this is just lunch stuff. Hey guys, so today we've pretty much stayed in the hotel. Uh, we're gonna go out a little bit later, um, but I've been taking some practice tests for tomorrow just to kind of prepare and we're just hanging out. I wanted to check in and give you guys a little bit of an update. Yeah, right now, or the first couple days, or the first day basically is just preparing for his test. The second day is going to be my test. <laughs> and then we'll see what's after because it's our anniversary. So, the celebration or the drinking to forget. We'll yeah. see. Yeah, <laughs> we'll one see or the other. <laughs> yeah, but, so we'll see. Um, yeah. But yeah, we're just hanging out. We might try this cool pizza place called Scenarios Pizza. We can see it right out of our hotel room. Sorry, I couldn't remember the name. <laughs> um, but yeah, right now we're just watching a movie, um, taking a break from practice tests. I wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update and just share with you our day a little bit. But yeah. yeah. All right, we'll check back in with you guys later. We're probably going to head out um, in a little while. Just I need to take one more practice test. I don't know what happened there with my with my word. <laughs> um, okay. But yeah, I'm gonna take one more practice test and then we're gonna head out in a little while and probably figure out what we can do around here. Yeah, try um, to go explore a little bit and see what's around us. Yeah, we don't know what there is really, and then we don't want to go to places that we have where we live, like McDonald's, Taco Bell, stuff like that. You know, try something Thanks. new. <laughs> um, but yeah, all right, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Well, we got out of the hotel, finally, um, and we found this place online called Rush Ranch. We're going to check it out, and we'll see if they allow filming, and we'll bring you along with us. It, they said you can get to know some of the horses, pet them, hike some trails and stuff. They close at 7, so we're not going to be able to be here too long, so we'll see what we can do. Proceed to the route. But, yeah, um, we'll see you guys in a little bit. Proceed to the route. Okay, so we parked our car. We're trying to figure out like where we can go and stuff, but it's really pretty. But there's not really anybody inside, so I'm not sure like, where we're really able to go. I'll let you know when we got when we find something, guys. I think this guy noticed us. He kind of stomped his hooves at us. Look at. Horse bite. Or oh, horse's bite. Do 
not put your fingers through the fences. Approaching horses without permission and supervision is at your own risk. All right, well then let's make sure we find somebody so we don't do that. Horses over there. And it says Marsh Trail, but and then it says pasture trail that way. You can choose two ways. Should we ask her if it's okay that we even be here? You know what? Alright guys, so we just talked to that girl that we saw prior in the car. Um, but now, we know that it is kind of a trust fund kind of thing. So... Or something like that so basically what it is is it's private property but it's open to the public and they are open from 8 to 7 and um, they have some trails this is the pasture trail it says there's some horses over there but they were getting fed so we didn't really want to bother them some kicking was going on Oh yeah, we saw some squirrels. He's like, it's really pretty. Hello, I think the other one. Yeah, it's a, just like a little detour. <laughs> it says you can pick two ways to go to this trail, and it literally just goes around that part. There's birds and some doves and stuff. I keep hearing that cow, but I don't see them. I know. Right? Oh, I think it's right there. <laughs> in the in the video, I was trying to get it, but it didn't work out. <laughs> Here we are on our hike, I guess you could say. <laughs> we weren't facing the camera first, so I was like guessing because they can see us. And I didn't know if you did want to see it. No, just kind of showing us since so we got to see a little bit of the landscape. Ooh, there's map. Uh, wow, I said wow. Uh, cow pies. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what is it? <laughs> Check me out. It's fresh. Yeah, it looked like really fresh. It's so pretty out here though. This is the part that's not on fire. Unpicked. Unpicked cotton, guys. A few cotton plants. Some back here, too. I'm sure that's where the water is. There was a place back where, um, oh, kind of where they were fishing. What is this? Connecting habitats? Connecting habitats, not connected. Oh, wow. 623, okay. We... Kind of, yeah.
gonna just go up to that hill and then start heading back. What? Well, I don't know how far it goes either. Yeah, they locked the gate at seven, so. <laughs> I have my test, yeah, no, we can't do that. We need to leave. Should we probably start heading back soon? Kind of a little bit of a walk. That's how far the trail is. Off. We're almost at the end of the trail. Just up this hill. I thought it would be a little bit long. Well, I don't know if this is really the end of the trail. This is just where we're stopping, I think, no? Yes. Yes, because they have to close, he said. Alright, let's show you the view from up here. So this is the view from up on the hill. Got some benches and stuff. Oh, look at the bird. Don't scare him off. We got this close and he hasn't flown, so. So we're heading back. Which which trail is this? This is the pasture trail. Yes, swamp. Swamps. <laughs> So we're not that far. It's only 6.35, but still. It went faster than we thought. That was the end of the trail. I Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> Probably not before the chest. Let's just get. There's like a burrito place I've seen somewhere. I don't think they'll be as good as the places we've been. But if you know what? I hope they prove me wrong. We'll see. Right? So we parked in the wrong spot, I think. And I think we just found a detour to our car. Anybody know what these are? Do you know what they are? Tell me in the comments below. It was, it's pretty cool. Here's the car. So that was fun. We are heading out now. Um, looks like there's a car already at the gate to block it. You try to stop? Uh, yeah, that's the um, guidance to the hotel. Bye, Rush. Um, what was it, Rush? <gasps> Is the gate already locked? Okay, guys. So we were tripping out. We thought the <laughs> gate was locked, but it's across the street. <laughs> oh. oh, Rush Ranch. There we go. Rush Ranch. Hey, guys. So I know I've been doing a lot of the talking, but he's been doing a lot of the driving for him. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm not on the insurance, so we don't want to risk it. But we don't get in and out a lot, and there's an in and out close. So we're going to get in and out. We're going to treat ourselves. In a quarter of a mile. Turn left onto Rock Hill Road. Shh, I'm recording. <laughs> Sorry. That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> no, not you. The... <laughs> oh, I'm kidding. <laughs> What's it called? But yes, we're going to get in and out because we don't really eat it. We never really go. It's really far and... It's not really far. It's just one town over and we don't really go to that town a lot. And yeah, we're just gonna... So we thought we were gonna have to eat at Denny's in the outside patio because we are not waiting in this line for um, in and out Burger. It's literally in the street. But we called and they said we can go in and order, so. This line got longer. Oh yeah, the line got longer. No, thank you. All right, Show we'll see you guys in a bit. Hey guys. Okay, so we're back. We got food. Um, we're gonna to grab in. Gonna try the animal fries. Never oh yeah, it. we're gonna try animal fries. We haven't tried animal fries. Let us know what you guys think about animal fries. Um, what's it called? But yeah, we're gonna eat. Call this a day. Well, yeah, um, I'm probably gonna day. do Start some more practice tests in a little bit and get ready for tomorrow. And go to bed pretty early because I gotta get up early. Ah, <laughs> I'm so scared. Okay, we'll talk to you guys later. Bye. Bye. Hey guys. So today is the big day. It's, what time is it? Um, the clock isn't plugged in. Okay, so it's 5.51. Our hotel clock isn't plugged in. And it hasn't been since we got here. We've just been using our phones. But, today's the big day. It's our anniversary. And that's five years together. And today is also my cosmetology test. My kit is ready to go. But yeah. We're just here getting ready. I'm gonna have to leave here in about maybe 30 minutes. But yeah, I'll let you guys know what happens afterwards. Sorry if we're not talking too much, it's still really early. <laughs> it's really early, yeah. <laughs> and then I'm really nervous, so we'll just see how this goes. And then we'll let you guys know by the end of the day. Yeah. All right, bye. Look, bye guys. <laughs> hey guys, so we're here outside of the place. My test is almost time. Um, very anxious. <laughs> very anxious. I kind of want to cry. I'm getting chills. Like, I don't know. <laughs> um, but I will let you guys know what happens, good or bad. So we'll see you guys afterwards. I'm not allowed to take phones or any electrical things. The only thing I have on me is my paper um, to get in, my ID, and my stuff that I'm going to use for the test. That's it. So, yeah, so...
that's it. We'll see you guys afterwards. He's gonna be at the hotel all day by himself, so. <laughs> see him like, what? Six, seven, seven hours, something like that? Yeah. Let's all right. <laughs> Talk to you guys later. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hey guys. Hey. Oh wait, so I took my cosmetology test today and I got the results. Uh, we were able to come home, take a couple dabs, um, relax for a little bit and then because it told us 30 minute wait and we went back, I got my results and I passed the written part. I didn't pass the hands-on part. Um, so still not licensed. Um, I have another try at the um, practical. I have to reapply, uh, pay the $75 or whatever it is, and then I can come back and retake it. Um, but it's half over. I don't have to retake the written. I just gotta retake the actual practical. I know what to expect. And I didn't even get that bad of a score. I got a 70 out of um, the highest score you can get is a 75 to pass, so I'm only like five points off. It's not even that bad, but um, I was still a little sad. I was really, really hoping to pass like both of them today and get my license today, right, but like a um, but yeah, no. Then we just finished eating some Wendy's. Um, it's our anniversary, so we're just gonna take the time today and relax and maybe go out. Um, See what there is to do. See what, yeah, see what there is to do because we leave Friday and tomorrow we're going to the Jelly Belly Factory. Um, and yeah, we'll just see what's up. But yeah, we'll Good. see you guys later. Bye. Bye. Hey guys. Hey. Okay, so we didn't really leave the hotel yet until now. Um, but we are going for our anniversary dinner. We're not going to actually eat there because they're not allowing. Um, outdoor dining or indoor because of COVID um, so we're just gonna pick it up but we've never tried red lobster so we thought we would try red lobster for dinner how then yeah some people are like oh yeah you know I've heard people talk shit about it but um, I'm still kind of excited yeah we're gonna give it a shot see if we like it ourselves but yeah so far it's been a good anniversary. We're gonna do more tomorrow because today uh, I was kind of booked with my test and all, you know, so. Um, yeah, we're gonna try to go to the Jelly Belly factory and maybe the beach, something fun, I don't know. Probably figure it out. hike, I'm hoping. Oh yeah, a hike. Yeah, he wants to do a hike, so we'll see about we a hike. a lot of trails by like water and stuff, and there's like a forest one that he likes too, so. If we go by water, we're getting mosquito repellent this time, because you got bit up last time. <laughs> yeah. At the swamps. The swamp. Hey guys, okay, so we got our food. Uh, I was like, I was so excited for food, and he goes, oh my god, you reminded me of that video we seen, there was this video we seen, right, on Facebook, and there was this uh, guy telling this girl, his, I think it's his girlfriend or wife or something, and she, uh, she was, he was like, yeah, let's go out uh, shopping or whatever, and she was like, yeah, we just can't go shopping, we have a baby, he's like, yeah, no, I called uh, your mom or my mom or something like that, we got a babysitter, let's go do this and this and that, and she's like getting so excited, like hyped and stuff. She runs out the bathroom, bathroom screaming, puts her mascara down and everything. So I was like, what the heck? He said I just reminded him of that. But yeah, no, I had to tell you guys too. <laughs> Let's say it's a success for our anniversary dinner. What do you think, babe? pretty good. I just wish we could have eaten there or something. Yeah, it would have been nice to eat there. But, I mean, we're together. It's fine. Yeah. Delicious food. My love. My love. <laughs> so, I was trying to eat the, the steak. It came out a little more pink than I thought. I thought I clicked the same um, kind that Nathaniel got, which was medium well. Instead, of, uh, instead I clicked medium rare. And so I was gonna throw it in the microwave for a little bit, right? Look at how pink this is. 
right? We do it in the microwave for one minute. Cooked all the way through. Got a good ass microwave in this hotel. <laughs>